Welcome to the art classroom. This is lesson 19. And dig out your old sewing machine because today we're going to do some stitch drawing. We'll need something to work with. I'm going to simplify this image by walking the pencil and creating a continuous line drawing. Let's prepare the sewing machine. The first thing we need to do is wind the bobbin. The bobbin provides thread for underneath the material. I've attached the bobbin onto the bobbin spinner and I've attached some thread onto it. And what I'm going to do is actually add thread onto the bobbin so that we can use it in the machine. It's time to thread the machine. The thread spool sits up top and you follow the directions on the machine, uh, usually taking thread down, up, through the take up lever and then back down again. Take it behind the little metal guide and then you thread through the needle. Okay, so let's add the bobbin and set up the machine. Bobbin goes in a little hole and you pull the thread underneath the little metal clasp. Holding both the threads, I'm moving the needle up and down just to loop both the threads together. And you should see that bottom thread coming up through the machine and you can just pull it out. So now you have your, both your threads at the top of the machine. You can put the cover back on again and we're ready to sew. My advice is to test out some of the stitches first. Um, I'm just going through some of the settings here on a piece of paper towel just to see what types of stitching this machine is going to give me. When I'm inserting material into the machine, I'm lifting and lowering the foot with the lever at the back. Think about the stitching as using different types of thick and thin line. Trace your image onto the cloth using a window. Add some wadding inside for a puffed effect. And it's time to turn the sewing machine needle into a pencil and start drawing. Art doesn't have to be what the person with no imagination thinks it is. Make it whatever you want it to be. Happy creating!